Good afternoon, Ray Colin here with TechOut. I've been getting a ton of questions um, in my last video showing Android P Developer Preview 2. Um, a lot of people are saying they don't have the little notch to the um, to do the swipe up from home button for your um, app switcher. The reason that would be is because you have to enable this. This is not enabled by default. You have to go into your settings and you need to scroll down to system, go to gestures, and turn on swipe up from home button. This is not enabled from default. You do need to turn this on. So if I turn it off here, you'll see we have the regular back, home, and app switcher button right here. So that will enable it normally just as it was on 7 and 8. So you do have to turn that on. Then you'll get the pill. You can still use it as a regular home button. Your back button will go away when it's not needed. And then to use your switcher, all you do is pull up or you can hold and slide to, not hold, but you can slide it to the side to tab between apps and it'll just keep going and you can go back and forth that way. If you are in an app, let's see, so if we open up Twitter here, you can switch to the side and go back and forth between your last two apps. Um, if you're going back and forth between two different apps, you can just swipe like that and it'll go back and forth between the two. And then just a half swipe up will get you to your app switcher and then a full swipe up will get you into your apps. So that is how that works. That's how that works on 9.0 Android P Developer uh, Preview 2. If you're watching this after Developer Preview 2, some of these settings may not apply. It may be set by default. Things will change after the beta is over. This has been Colin with TechOut. If you guys enjoyed this video, click the thumbs up. And as always, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And have a great day.